So finally, we're going to take a look at file management and settings within MagicQ. So the first thing we're going to do is take a look at the file manager that's built into the MagicQ software. So if I go to the setup window, if I'm in view settings, you'll find the file manager soft key just here. If I select this, it takes us to our MagicQ show folder. So this is where all of your MagicQ show files are stored. And you'll see in this folder, there's three different types of show files. So we've got .shw files, .sbk files, and .xhw files. The differences between these are .shw is your main show files that you've manually saved yourself. .sbk files are automatically generated backup files. And .xhw contains some show assets such as media and icons. You'll also find in here, we've got our heads folder just here. And in here, you'll find all of the heads that you've got loaded onto your desk and you can bring those in and out of this folder as you need them if you need to import some, some custom made heads from elsewhere, for example. All right, so if I go back to the setup window, now I'm going to talk a little bit about settings in MagicQ. So there's two different types of settings, really. You'll notice in the setup window here, some of the settings have red flags next to them. What this means is that they're console settings as opposed to show file settings. So when you load in a show file, by default, it will bring only in the show file settings. So it won't bring in console settings such as your IP address or DMX settings. If you want to bring those in as well, there's an option for that. So if we hold down shift in the setup window, you'll find you've got load show plus con on this soft button here. So what that does is it loads up your show file plus your console settings as well. So you'd select that soft key and then you'd select the show file you want to load in and it will bring all of the settings with it. So that's settings. We can also merge show files together as well. So say for example, in this case, I've got a show file where I haven't got my spots patched. I want to bring those in from another show file. So to do this, it's a similar process. I'm going to again, hold down the shift key in the setup window and this time select import show. I'm going to select advanced and then select the show file I want to import. So I've already got open the show file that I want to import things into and I'm now selecting the show file that I want to import things from. So in this window here, I'm going to select what I want to import. I want the patch, palettes. I don't want queues, queue stacks and playbacks or grids. And I also want the visualizer position for these fixtures. I want to select what I want to merge into current data in this show file. And I only need to merge in palettes in this option. I also need to select whether I want all head files from the show or choose which ones I want to import. So in this show file, I've only got these Maverick Mark II spots, so I just need to leave that on all to import all of those spots. If I click done, you'll see these spots have appeared in the visualizer. If I go to the patch window, you can see I've now got all 12 of these spots patched. If I go to layout one, I can select the spots, locate them, and you can see I've got all of these palettes set up already. All of that data has been imported into this existing show file. So that covers all of the content for the MagicQ Intermediate Training Series. If you have any questions or queries at all, please do feel free to contact us at support at camsys.co.uk. Thanks for watching.